go in the alleys and see what we can find today. These are five ninety nine. How many should I buy? Let's see. If I sell them for thirty dollars, they're going to take about fourteen percent. Then I got to do the cost. It's going to be minus six dollars and forty two cent. Then I'm going to have to ship it. It's going to be about eight dollars. I could make a possible 11.38 each. Got to leave some for other people. We might have a deal on Amazon. Sales rank of 120. Uh, it requires approval. Don't know if I'm gonna get approved. I doubt it. Nope. Oh well, let's go. Right, I want to show y'all something before I put all these in, in the trunk of my car. Um, she rang all these up as $4.99 each. Um, they were advertised as $5.99 each. But if you look at the box right here, this one says $4.99. So she rang all of them up, $4.99. And you can see my total right there is $106.79 for 20 of them. I'm tempted to go back in and get the other ones because I'm saving a dollar on each one of them. But y'all, if you want to sell on eBay and if, or if you can get approved over on Amazon, I would pick these things up for five or six dollars. Um, the price on Amazon is $27.99. So there you go. Okay, guys, I know it's a little dark in here and I'm in the house, but there's a reason I only got charged $4.99 for those uh, bug zappers. It was because there is a battery operated version that requires two double A's that are $4.99 and she rang them all up at that price. The rechargeable ones um, are $5.99, so just wanted to clear that up. Mm -hmm. 